May Musk is the mother of the richest man on the planet, Elon Musk. She was born in 1948 in Canada, and later married a successful but viciously abusive man. May then left that marriage and ventured out on her own as a single mother of three, and eventually became a supermodel mother to three fantastically successful children, one of whom has changed the world in ways we still can't fully appreciate. In today's video, we will explore the incredible life of May Musk, an enigmatic, successful, and proud mother, and see how her life has profoundly shaped the world and the trailblazing paths of her three children. So stay tuned till the end of this video. Born in April 1948 in Regina, Saskatchewan, Canada, May was a twin and one of five children in the family. Shortly after her birth, in 1950, her family relocated to Pretoria, South Africa. Her father, Dr. Joshua Norman Haldeman, a chiropractor and amateur archaeologist, and mother Winifred Josephine Fletcher, were amazingly adventurous. Growing up, May says her parents may not have been wealthy, but their home sparked an early interest in nutrition thanks to all the surrounding fruit trees. May considered herself to be a science nerd in grade school, so much so that teachers asked her to teach math to classes of older children. As a result, she would get bullied until her twin sister Kay fought the other students off. In her adolescence, May helped her father with his chiropractor clinic, working as a receptionist and putting client newsletters together. They were so adventurous, in fact, that May and her family flew across the world in a plane in 1952. In true Indiana Jones style, the family spent almost 10 years wandering the Kalahari Desert in pursuit of the famous lost city of the Kalahari. Her mother would pack a supply of water, food, and gasoline every year, and the family of five would leave with a map and a compass. She later claimed in an interview that they would trek to the desert for three weeks. If the family didn't emerge from the desert on time, her father would send out scouts on camels to look for them. The family, with its motto, live dangerously, carefully, would travel throughout the day and then sleep in sleeping bags on the ground at night. Musk recalls seeing many animals and meeting many Bushmen tribes, some of whom had never seen a car before the late 1950s. They had never seen other humans before and they were intrigued, just as we were. Following the family's decade-long treasure hunt, May Musk began modeling when she was 15 years old. Despite being advised her modeling career would be over by the time she turned 18, she went on to work as a print and runway model for decades. She told Vanity Fair that her friends tell her that she was famous before Elon was famous. She was even a finalist in the Miss South Africa beauty pageant in 1969 when she was just 21 years old. In 1970, at the age of 22, she married South African engineer Errol Musk whom she had met in high school. She became pregnant with Elon while on their honeymoon. Then the couple had three children together, Elon, Kimball, and Tosca Musk. Interestingly, Elon's name was inspired by her American grandpa, John Elon Haldeman. While she was raising her young family, she never neglected her studies. She went on to the University of the Orange Free State in South Africa to pursue a master's degree in dietetics. She also went on to the University of Toronto for a second master's degree in nutritional science. This qualification as a dietitian proved to be extremely useful later in life. Musk's children had to be self-sufficient from an early age due to her and her husband's hectic schedules. She claimed, I was putting in a lot of hours. They didn't see me very much. Fortunately, I was able to work from home. I always had my practice at home and they just understood they had to behave, do their own schoolwork, and make their own decisions. She says she taught them the same way her parents had taught her. I brought my children up like my parents brought us up. To be independent, kind, honest, considerate, and polite. To work hard and do good things. Married life with Errol Musk came with some degree of affluence as the family had one of the biggest residences in Pretoria, owing largely to Errol's business success. However, living with Errol proved to be a terrible life with both physical and mental abuse. Errol was described by Elon as a terrible human being during a November 2017 interview with Rolling Stone. Elon later said in other interviews that his father is good at making life miserable. That is for sure. He is not a happy man. According to Elon, his father has done almost every evil thing anyone could possibly think of. While asking May about her husband, she said, 
I got married to a person who was aggressive, and then he said he would change when we got married, and he got worse. May ended the marriage when she finally divorced Errol in 1979. A divorced woman who was 31 years old struggled to make ends meet. May shared in an interview with the Huffington Post, After my divorce, I had to work and feed three kids without maintenance. Poverty makes you work really hard. I remember crying when one of the kids spilled milk. The saying goes, don't cry over spilled milk. I cried because I couldn't buy another milk that day. May survived by buying secondhand clothes and using her dietitian skills to provide cheap and nutritious meals, such as peanut butter sandwiches and bean stews. Staying afloat also required hard work, but she explained to CNBC, I never felt guilty about working full time because I didn't have a choice. Taking care of my children was my top priority. I worked hard to keep a roof over our heads, food in our stomachs, and basic clothes on our backs. This experience, following the divorce, helped to forge a great bond between her and her children. At the age of 41, May and her children left South Africa and moved to Toronto. Elon was 18 at the time, with Kimball 17 and Tosca 15. She worked five jobs as she built a new life in Canada and lived in a rent-controlled apartment where they survived on a very limited budget. We could not afford to dine out. I had a client with a butcher. Once a month, he would give me a beef roast. I would cut it up into four pieces and freeze three so that we could cook one so we could eat meat once a week. Her modeling career, however, continued in Canada and the United States with great success. When modeling, May would often bring her three children to her shows. She has been on special case cereal boxes and in some other advertisements. Even after Elon Musk's great success, she didn't stop. IMG, a major modeling agency, signed her in 2016 at the age of 68. She became a CoverGirl ambassador in 2017 at the age of 69. While talking about her kids, she said Kimball is the perfect child, not the best. She always had to search for Elon, who was constantly on one quest or another. He once fell off a roof, and he endured several episodes that required stitches. He refused to sleep, and instead stayed up until 5 o'clock in the morning to read, which meant she had a hard time waking him up in the morning in time for school. May Musk is the longest serving brand ambassador in the history of the cosmetics industry. We can confidently say that May Musk has lived a storied and fulfilled life, and she has had the greatest fortune a mother could ever ask for. In her recent memoir, she wrote, My kids benefited because they saw me work hard just to put a roof over our heads, put food in our stomachs, and purchase second-hand clothes. They want you to know how much I struggled, as life looks so easy for me now.